Well, hi there. I'm Carlisle McFugget, and today I'm here to show you how to do some tree work. Oh, hi there. I'm Carlisle McFugget, and today I'm going to show you how to do tree work. Was it I or O? I thought O was on. Oh, hey. I'm Carlisle McFugget. Today I'm going to show you about doing some tree work. Now the first thing you want to talk about is running a chainsaw. It really doesn't matter how safe you are with these things. What really matters is how cool you look holding it. Now this is extremely important. You want to know what you're going to look like when someone shows up, whether it be a female or an authority figure. Another thing I think that's smart to do before you start your chainsaw is call your local police department by dialing 911 and let them know there's likely to be an accident. Yes, I live at 2216 Wilson Road. Something real bad's about to happen. Now they'll be ready in case something should go wrong. Now when trimming a tree, two things are important. One, what you look like. And number two, what you're going to do. We're going to take a few limbs off of this tree. Limbs are usually high because trees are tall. And to get high, you're going to need something safe to stand on. There, that looks nice and tall. Now we can reach our branches. Now that we've got our branch down safely, we can cut it into small pieces of firewood. Now the next thing we're going to talk about is actually cutting down a tree. Now the customer has already marked this tree for removal. What's that? Now that you've selected your tree, it's important to remember to watch out for snakes. Because snakes will fuck you up. Now I had a cousin once. He lived over there by, uh, oh, I think the bar's name was Lynn's. Or Jim's. Or Tim's. It was Tim's. <clears throat> Tim's bar. And he was taking trash out one night and got bit by a snake. And it fucked him up. So you want to make sure to watch out for snakes. Thought I heard one over here. Another thing that's important before you cut a tree down is to look around and make sure none of your neighbors are out.
That wasn't so hard. Now you're doing tree work like a real professional. Get in there real quick. Get a good shot at that chain there. That's it. <clears throat> now take a look at this chain. Now you see the, sh the chain's got to be sharp right there because sharp is important for cutting things. If it's not sharp, it won't cut. And you don't want to try and cut with a chain that's not sharp. The next part of our segment is to talk about drugs. They're not good. You don't want to get wrapped up in that shit. Because you can fuck your life up. Now I know a lot of people have fucked up their life on drugs. It's not cool, man. If you're gonna do drugs, make sure you do just enough of them. Don't do too many. If you do too many, you're gonna get fucked up. That's what drug abuse really is. You're abusing the drug. No one says you can't have one or two, as long as it's not heroin, you know? I'd say it's really, you know, I, there's a few out there I wouldn't fuck around with, you know? Took me a long time to come to that conclusion. And you guys are lucky I caught you in time. So, really, you know, just, you know, get out there and fuck around a little bit. But don't, don't fuck around too much. You know what I'm saying? 